What's going on guys, Copert here. Welcome to my Timber and Stone Let's Play Season 4. This is day 47, early morning. Uh, probably guesstimating 52, 53, maybe upwards of 55 citizens in our town now. Uh, I've been working overnight, just trying to backfill some land in preparation for farm, and I just got this weird little message. Gerard has died due to starvation. Your settlement needs more food. No, I don't. I got 5,100 food. Uh, the only thing I could guess, this is Gerard down here is he's stuck, seemingly. So, I'm guessing good old Gerard got stuck somehow. So, I'm, yeah, Gerard, Gerard, Gerard has perished. Now, what are you doing? You can move, too? Are you guys getting glitched out in here? Sure seems like it. I don't know what's going on. I don't, I'm guessing, I think he, because there was a guy down here sleeping. And uh, I'm guessing that Let's just cancel that out. We don't need it that badly. Um, maybe he went to sleep and somebody built a, you know, a stockpile on top of him. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know what that's about. And it's, it's, it's becoming kind of apparent, actually, that I need some more beds. Because I got guys just sleeping all over on the ground over here and stuff. So that's what this little cubby room is going to be. Um... I've been like I've been blowing through tools like at an insane rate. It's it's kind of crazy. It's actually quite crazy, to be honest. Um, like my my hose, I can't look. I have eighty two hoes now. I just made a hundred of them. And and pickaxes, I think are the same thing. And and axes, I'm actually gonna run out of right here very soon. So we are. Yeah, that's fine. So I'm just going to throw down here. I'm throwing a couple. Hopefully that's going to work. I don't know. I'm just going to throw a couple um, beds down here for the miners so that they don't have to go anywhere. I feel like that'll really kind of help them out. Let's uh, queue up a couple axes that we built. This, I, the axes are like the one thing I haven't had to build much of, thankfully. Move to the top. Rope. We don't really need... Well, we're not bad. I mean, we got plenty of flax fiber. Ah, man, I got so many trees. I gotta get those done. Uh, bricks and everything looking pretty good. So, yeah, I just got the mine in here. Mostly because I need raw stone. Actually, we're going so slow right now. I'm so used to playing at the higher speed. We had another archer graduate. So, we only have one here, which will be nice. It'll stop chewing through my wood so bad. I can even probably use the wood again for the furnaces. You can see I'm filling in here. I did some plaster here. I got some wood. These guys are not moving very quickly, which is kind of uh, weird. I don't know. I just feel, I feel like things are moving slowly, and it's kind of frustrating. <laughs> so we're just gonna we're gonna add the fire break there. That looks fine. Let's see how it looks when it's all filled in. Fill that in. That should be enough to at least get our one field going. Um, yeah, so what I'm going to do... Yeah, see, this is the problem. I don't have the stone in here. So I'm just going to kind of do that raw stone, and the rest can be plaster. Oh, man, i got to make more already. As I told you, I don't like to uh, use the plaster too close to the wall, because I feel like that might burn. So it's, I feel like I'm building this stuff just constantly. Okay. Yeah, got our little pen here. I'm ready to switch that over. Why don't we do that right now? Let's see what we can, how this is going to work. Livestock in here. That looks like... Okay, so that didn't work, obviously. to remove this. There we go. Alright, so it's just gotta be... I probably should have done this first. Inside the fence. Oh man, am I not able to... Yeah, I might have to get rid of this stuff. Not sure. Why would I have to deconstruct this, though? That doesn't make any sense, but whatever. I don't remember how I did it the first time. Go. Now let's get uh, 
I did this before, didn't I? There we go. Figured it out quickly. Excellent. Right in the middle. I had a couple hay bales in here. I just felt they gave a little more effect. Oh, there we go. Courageous, disloyal food feathers. You are a forager. You don't go forage. Go ahead. Go, dog. I'm pretty good on people, so I'd like to actually have someone... Look at that. Oh, I thought it was a mustache. Uh, wait on hole and idle. Gather berries. Hunt. Do not hunt chicken. Hunt boar. Hunt sheep. Uh, sleep. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, what I want you to do, though, always carry a knife. Thinking about giving you a bow, but I think it's, that gets all glitchy. So yeah, that's good. Whatever. If you run into trouble, I don't know. There's not much we can do for you. That looks really weird, doesn't it? Like, I guess once they build it, it goes on top. So once those, uh, let's get this guy filled up. Let's let her fill that up, and then we'll we'll move the animals over. Oh, you're gonna go right over there. That's great. No, it's oh, there's a chicken over there though. No, it's a chicken. That's a skeleton. What are you... You're going to go with that, those animals. Come on, dude. Not the brightest guy, obviously. Just head out this way. I'm sure there's good stuff out here. Your job is basically to be to find... So I get so many notifications now. Settlement needs more food. That's crazy. Crazy talk. All right. So you can see I've got a, I've got a mess over here of, of just silly stuff going on. Fieldstone. I think I have to make some more of this now soon. I only made this three, didn't I? I think that's where we were at with that. Run out of dirt. Using it up right now, but I'm using it up pretty hard, so. Um, let's just talk here then about where we're going to have this. Well, let's see. We've got corn seeds, so corn's going to be a big one. So we want a decent sized little farmer. So I'm wondering if we. Trying to see how that's going to go. If I can get... I'm thinking... 20 by 5. That's a lot of corn. A little room for a little barn in there. Sounds pretty good to me. Let's do that. Everything lines up pretty good. Yeah, it works. Now I have one space, I'll do another crop. Cotton, wheat, potato, carrot, pumpkin. So we got carrot seeds. The next one we got a lot of. And that's going to get us, you know, close. We've got one more kind of crop in there. I'm not going to worry too much about the wheat. Well, actually, wheat I, I do need to worry about. Um, I'm not sure where or what I'm going to... What I'm going to do for that. So, what we're going to do here, we're going to do um, storage food barrel. We're going to do. Why is this not letting me build it in there? Doesn't make any sense. So, one there, one there. Do like. I just got to do it off of space, huh? I'll leave it like that for now. I'm not worried about getting max and max efficiency. As you can see, my, my I'm working plenty efficiently enough right now. We get rid of this. I don't need that over there anymore. We'll just start moving this over here. So that's relatively close as we push on to fill all this in. What is that? Game saved. All right, so hopefully they'll plant that crop pretty quick. Um, it won't affect us too badly. So let's go in here. Did this get filled? No, there's no food in there yet. There's no food in there yet. I have, I have wheat. Where is she? What is she doing? Where is she hanging out? Sleeping, maybe? Is that her? Yep, that's fine. 
Let's just get you out of here. I want to see what happens. Go fill the, that trough for me, please. And they're getting that filled up. That's fine. All right, so we're going to have, you know, some crops here. I'm trying to look city-wise. Yeah, that's fine, because then we'll have, you know, the Main Street here. I'll have some buildings in here. And back over in this corner will be the little little farmer with the, with the animals. A little house in here. A couple crops, and that'll look nice and tidy up over there in the corner. Like I said, may probably have one more large crop, or, or at least reserve an area. Actually, you know what I'll probably do? I'll probably do, like, a little squares in here for... Some wheat for sure, some cotton, maybe some, uh, I don't even know what I plant. This is what? That's carrots, so we'll have, like, potatoes and stuff. So we'll get it in there. I like corn. Uh, you know, it, it pops up nicely. We have a ton of seeds of that for some reason. Um, flax. I, I'm going to need a flax farm. So, yeah, that'll all be there. I'm just waiting for them to fill all this in. Um, yeah, so, I mean, everything's going pretty good. It's just a matter of waiting on resources, really. I'm gonna have to come up with a design, and this is gonna be, uh, this is what I'm saying, this is like gonna be really weird for me to come up with a design of like a house. I don't, I don't, I mean, I can't remember the last time I tried to design a legit house. Like something that looks good, like a, like a, something that doesn't look like a fort. <laughs> nothing, nothing, it doesn't look like a, you know, fortification type thing or a bunker. Something that looks like an actual livable, you know, home style house. So I, I might even have to like go online and look for some inspiration, that kind of stuff, because I, I don't even know where to start right now. Because obviously I want to do, you know, more of a barn. Do we want to do? Yeah, I think I think actually a barn would be better than like a, a legit house over here. We got some beds and stuff in the barn, but I was gonna say we'll do the barn here. We'll do like um, some food barrels and stuff in there. But that I'll probably put some hay bales around and stuff, but. Food bowels in there and stuff wouldn't be good because then if God forbid this barn ever got hit and burnt to the ground, that would our food would take a pretty good hit. Now that's why it's not being built. Do I not have any field stone? No, I got some. Let's just queue some more up. Move to the top. Okay, they're building a lot more plaster, so that's partially why that stalled. I have not really been too crazy about, um, here, we're just gonna pull off here a little bit, I'm gonna do the rest in, see the problem is I, I need some, I need those guys to do some serious mining down there, I haven't been going crazy about getting the, the dirt out, which I, I should, I should start getting back into that habit, all this stuff can go, it's so much storage of mining stuff. Uh, the builder's cars can go. That's good. Clear all that out. The wood logs, I think, can probably... Yeah, wood logs can go. It's going to make them less efficient. I'll put a little... Wood, log, wood pile up here. Right over there. That's fine. That should be good. Get us, get us, these guys are going to have to go, too. But I do want to get this dirt out of here. It's a nice big track of dirt. I'm starting to run low on it again. So I'm not going to go crazy about getting all of it. But, you know, where there's a nice little spot like this, I'll grab it. Because, you know, I was at like four or 5,000. It's at like two now. So clearly I'm, I'm using more and more. Got to be careful with that. So you go. I'm basically gonna have them fill in this probably this whole area here. So it's nothing we really have to do on camera. Uh, you can see the farm's already started. I, I don't know where my carpenter is. He must be sleeping, frankly. And they should be filling. I don't. They don't want to do the field zone for some reason. I don't know what's going on. They don't really have a ton queued up for them either. So there you go, man. It's coming. It's coming. All these designations. So there you go, you have your farms over here. Eventually I can get rid of these farms. Not yet, obviously. But we're getting there. As soon as the farms are up and I'm comfortable that they're running in the, the livestock, did you fill this yet? Yes, yeah, she did fill it. So let's get in here. Move that. Now let's see what she does. Where did she go? There she is. So she should transfer the animals over, I think. I think that's what she'll do. 
I don't know what she's doing. Oh, there she goes. Don't kill them, please. <laughs> that would be terrible. Yep, she's going to move them right over there for me. Perfect. I can break all this down, clean all this up, get this mess out of here. Okay, she's going to harvest them one at a time. Uh, she left the food in here. Okay, that's fine. At least there'll be food there. And then I'm going to love getting rid of this farm stuff. I'm just trying to think if I want to maybe... It's weird that they, they let you put it there, but they don't let you put it in between like that. So, I mean, worst case efficiency is going to have to walk. It's not too bad. Not not optimal, but not too bad. Is she grabbing another one for me? What is she doing here? There you go. Grab one. Grab one. What are you doing? You're wasting my hay. All right, there you go. You're taking some over. Excellent. Yeah, I'll probably do like little little squares for some flax, some hay, and, and stuff like that to make my, you know, more in the cotton. I don't, I don't need a lot of this. You can see I don't have much hair at all. I don't use a ton, but it's nice to have when you do randomly need it. When I do the barn, I'll have a couple of resource crates. I mean, you know, I'll have a food crate or two in there too. So, okay, she's going to transfer that all over for me. That's going to be good. So, yeah, I think that'll wrap up episode 47. We're into the afternoon already. We had it running pretty slow. But you can see tonight I'm going to focus on filling this corner in. That's going to be, wow, that's going to bring this all up to grade pretty much. We're, we're getting pretty close there. The miners are obviously busy down below right now, so they're going to take a little while. But that's okay because I need to stop. Oh, what are they doing? I just have so much block and stuff, like block and plaster and everything being produced that as soon as they mine something, so it's almost almost gone. So I'm going to redesignate some of this. And we're just going to keep moving on, guys. But thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for the feedback. And if you got any more, always post it down below. I read everything. I try to answer every comment as best I can. Uh, like I said, pretty soon I'm going to have to do a big name day where I name a whole bunch of the new citizens. Uh, traders coming, so I'm going to check that out. Um, but So if you're interested, again, post in the comments. Let me know. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll talk to you next time. Just Take kidding, care. guys. We popped back. It was probably like three or four minutes since I left you guys and got a nice, nasty little message. Uh, merchant's arriving. We said that. I don't know if that merchant's going to arrive anymore. But look, a spider matriarch was spotted by Emma. This thing is pretty close. This is why it's good to have... You know, we just sent her out not long ago. It's really good to kind of have them going out there and walking around because he was pretty darn close, man. And uh, this is another... Um, Who's he, what's, what's it called? Migrant. So I have to kind of watch myself here. What I'm going to do, add another guard position out of it kind of here. Now that just be archers. Yep. Because I should have the archers for it. And we're going to put, yeah, you like right another one up there. I think should be good. Um, yeah, she's gonna be kind of cut off, which I don't really like. Put you there. I'll make that just archers, and then we're gonna put another one over here. And that's that, so let's let them go there. I should be pretty good, though. I, I have I have plenty of, of archers. I have good archers. I think we'll be okay. As we get closer, we do have the trebuchet. We should have somebody in here. This one preferably would be great. How are you, Hildegrad? You're level 16 already, so your preference is going to be operate siege weapons. That would be perfect. You're my lowest ranking archer. Uh, but basically, I'm not going to do this right now. I feel like the other episode's too long, but I wanted to let you know it happened so quickly. We When we come back... Uh, hopefully it'll be in tomorrow morning or something, but if it's not, it'll be in the nighttime. I'll hit record again and we will handle it. We'll have an exciting little episode. I don't think this one's going to last. I'm going to die to one hit. I think pretty much Emma is a goner. <laughs> I'm actually more worried about Mr. Jewett's over here. So what we're going to do, we're going to move him over here. We're going to try to bring him in the old back door. I'm swimming around and come in over here. Hopefully the spider doesn't follow him. And you can see, we're getting some more farm markets. Literally, it was only a couple minutes past since we uh, last spoke. So we're going to have him run around this way. Go, 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 Jouettes. Come on. Yeah, Emma. And you can just you can just bolt because you're, you're just done. I might let you guys see her get crunched because that's pretty much going to happen. 
but it's kind of good. She's she's valiantly leading the monster away from the, the her friends, which is great. Pretty pretty nice of her. Oh, no, what a nice migrant overeater. We should send you right out as well. Oh, Alice. I don't know where it is. The spider matrix has been spotted, and Emma has died. Doesn't even tell me how. Oh, there. Bite hits Emma in the legs, and it's just just so OP. All right, let me get this one that just joined. And then we'd have to watch Juwets. I think he should be able to get back. He's a little slow right now, but that's because he's loaded up with stuff. All right, sorry, Mr. Trader. Didn't really get to do much with you. Alice, you're the carpenter. No, Alice, we're going to make you a miner because I, I just need stone so badly. Um, okay, but that's going to wrap it up, guys. We will come right back, hopefully, episode 48, or at least day 48, and we'll see what happens. Take care, guys.